Yim Din Chai Village is one of the few villages in Hong Kong rich in catechism and Hakka culture. I myself was born here. I took my primary education here up to 12. We have sea to catch fish and mud flat to catch crabs and swim. Very wonderful activities in our childhood. Here, we are close and harmony with the earth, in the sky, and the nature. From the World War II, villages were beginning to move out from this village to the urban area in Hong Kong and European countries. These are our traditional uh, Hakka houses, abandoned for more than 30 years. The last family of this village left here, this island, in 1998. The village started the conservation of the saw pen in 2011. In my childhood, the saw pen here was totally deserted. The reason why we wanted to conserve this saw pen is to honor our ancestor because they started this village from their bare hand and to let this tradition salt making technique to restore again and pass down to our next generation. Starting at Yim Tin Zai, we will have six artworks and then three more at Sharp Island. Although the Arts Festival is located on outlying islands in Sai Kong, but it's very close to you. You can come to our island to enjoy walking on the Tobono. You can get your feet wet. Also, you can come to Yim Tin Zai to enjoy the amazing Hakka cuisine. In Hong Kong, we always have a saying about a hidden gem of nature. I think Sharp Island is not a super big island, but um, there are so many geological and ecological special features like old volcanic rocks um, that you cannot find elsewhere. There's um, a very beautiful sea line, very nice water and beach. This is the starting point of the hiking trail. There are 10 pieces of ceramics along the hiking trail. Let's go! One of the most special features would be the pineapple bun rock. At the same time, pineapple bun is something loved by every single Hong Kong person. So we wanted to make this the core of the whole storyline of the 10 ceramic pieces. When people come here, they can search for the art pieces because they are sort of like hidden in the nature and all along the hiking trail. So it would be like a treasure hunt experience for them. The entire arts festival will cover three years, starting from Yim Tin Zai and Sharp Island, and it is extends to Kao Sai Zhao and High Island in the coming two years. In the coming two years, we hope to invite international artists to come. We hope that they will bring us the new insight and then the global experience, and then to let our visitors to enjoy another part of this.